The conscientious objector of World War One. So, what's yeah. it like playing a part like that? Really, really difficult first to kind of understand what it was like. I don't think many people could go through what he went through. Nobody, because it, I think if a lot of people understood his reasons, they would have almost um, appreciated it and understood more. It's been a, a really great experience and it's been really fun practicing everything and it's just been amazing. Well, I didn't actually know anything about World War One before this but then I learned about how it started and what it was like during that and what it was like to be a conscientious objector and it's just, it, I've learned a lot from this. It's going to be absolutely amazing just to be on stage looking at that when people probably won't be able to do it and it's like a one in a lifetime opportunity. I think it's been an amazing experience being able to contact with other people, getting people in like doing different things, learning about the past which is amazing, something that I can get to do which is an honour. My favourite part is just being involved really, um, there's not really another opportunity where you get to do stuff like this. Well, there's been times where it's not exactly been the easiest but we've all supported each other and worked really hard to get to where we are. It's hard to part I know. 